The liver is unusual in that it has a dual blood supply, receiving arterial blood, 20% 25%, from the common hepatic artery and nutrient-rich venous blood, 75% 80% from the portal vein. The common hepatic artery usually arises as one of three branches off the celiac trunk, coursing to the right to enter the lesser omentum anterior to the portal vein. It branches into the proper hepatic and gastroduodenal arteries just above the duodenum, while within or just before entering the porta hepatis, The proper hepatic artery divides into right and left hepatic arteries, which continue to branch and supply the lobes of the liver. The right hepatic artery is larger than the left and supplies the majority of the right lobe of the liver. It passes posterior to the uncinic process of the pancreas and runs along the posterior wall of the common bile duct into the right hepatic lobe. The left hepatic artery approaches the liver in the lesser omentum and branches to supply the caudate, quadrate, and medial and lateral segments of the left lobe of the liver. The venous drainage of the liver occurs via the small interlobar and intersegmental hepatic vessels that merge into the three major hepatic veins, emptying directly into the IVC, just below the diaphragm. The right hepatic vein, the largest, lies between the right anterior and posterior hepatic segments. Drain segments 5, 6, and 7. and enters the IVC at the right lateral aspect. The middle hepatic vein lies in the interlobar fissure, drain segments 4, 5, and 8, and then enters the IVC at the anterior or right anterior surface. The smallest hepatic vein the left hepatic vein courses between the medial and lateral segments of the left lobe, drain segments Roma 2 and Drain 3, then enters the left anterior surface of the IVC. Segment 1 drains directly into the IVC through smaller hepatic veins. Frequently, the middle and left hepatic veins converge to form a common trunk before emptying into the IVC just below the diaphragm. The IVC lies in a groove along the posterior wall of the liver and ascends into the thoracic cavity through the caval hiatus of the diaphragm and enters the right atrium of the heart. 